Hello everyone and welcome back to Echoes of the Plum Grove. My name is Melanie V. We are now on to Sunday the 14th of spring in the year 1701. And it looks like we got our farming skills up again. Deja vu? <laughs> okay, so we have gotten the chance to get silver or gold quality crops. And we've also got a recipe for a small ice box. Very nice. And best of all, our smallpox is gone! Finally! It took forever, didn't it? But our heart level is not looking so good. Um, maybe we should eat something. We have a bunch of cherries. I guess we can eat that. And let's look at our quest. So we still have one to complete that we have just one day left. Bread and cheese. We'll get some flour and coin for that. And... This one requires journey cake. Can we make either of those things? Uh, journey cake. We will need some flour and milk. Don't have either, so no. And bread and cheese. Right here. Bread and cheese. Literally just bread and cheese. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't think we can make either of those items. Let's have a look and see what's in our chest right now. We got a bunch of junk. Why do we have so much junk? Let's try to get these things stacked nicely. I'll put them into my pack for now. And we can transfer them back over. Now they're stacked. Um, we have some muscles. I'm going to take that with us in case we can sell some stuff today. Oh, we got a couple of recipes as well. We should just learn those. Let's put the wood away. And what else should we take with us? Um, I don't think we need our hoe. We might go into the mines, finally. So I'll keep that with me. We'll put the tallow away. The stone can stay right here. And you never know if we're going to need to chop down a tree. So we'll take our axe. But let's put the nails away. We got some sand we can put away too. What is this stuff? Oh, dirt. Where do we get dirt from? Ah, doesn't matter. It's gonna hang out in here for now. So, yeah, we got a bunch of stuff in here. But what we need is some bread and some cheese. Let's head on outside. And we got a lot of crops that are not doing so good. No surprise there. But we should go ahead and water what we can and let's learn these as well okay this is i have no idea a scarecrow blueprint let's learn that one too and learned what's in our mailbox Oh, we got a bunch of mail. A funeral for Mary. What? Goodbye, Mary. And for James. James is gone too. Matthew is gone. Is everyone gone? Gigi has passed away. Edwin has passed away. Bridget has passed away. Oh my goodness. We've lost so many people. We got a fishing request from Jessup Edwards. Um, six brooch, hey? I've seen the brooch before, I just don't remember where. Okay, well, we got a few quests we need to complete. Are we going to be able to complete all these? Uh, I doubt it. Especially these ones that we have so little time left on. But for now, let's water some crops. And we still have to figure out what we can do with our wheat. But let's have something to eat. We'll eat some strawberries. We'll eat a bunch of strawberries. Are we going to get full at any point? Is this healing our heart at all? Okay, we're just about maxed for our hunger but our hearts are still not so good and we are really really well rested right now okay i think we should get into town 
So we'll take a shortcut in. We'll take the signpost travel. And we need to collect every freebie we can because we are broke. We'll say hello to Wilma. And on away we shall go. So we really didn't get to participate in the fishing festival yesterday. But you know, we were pretty much close to death. So yeah, we couldn't. The bakery, is the bakery open today? It is, thank goodness. I need some bread. We'll say hello to Amelia. And... Uh-oh, she's got the smallpox too. I hope she's not going to infect us again. Um, is it one of those things you can't get again? I hope so. Let's do a little trade. Cornbread, journey cakes. Oh, she has journey cakes for sale. Let's just buy two of those. Um, we can buy flour to make bread. Since she doesn't seem to be selling any bread. Okay, so journey cakes cost 28 each. Let's put up some items for trade. Um. Wow. This is going to leave us with not a whole lot of money. But we're going to take it. Okay, thanks Martha. I hope you get better soon. And I hope you don't pass away. We'll say hello to Alice. She has a quest. She wants four potatoes. Oh, I had potatoes, but I had to eat them to survive. So no can do. See you around. Okay, out we go. <laughs> well, things does not look very good for us right now, but we can complete one quest. So let's head over to the butcher shop. Hopefully it is actually open and we can make this delivery right now. Otherwise, we'll be out of luck for money. What? I wonder if he's going to come out of there. I wish people would come out of their shops or let me in even though I can't purchase anything. How rude. And we'll say hello to Mabel. What does she have for trade? She is selling some honey. Well, we don't need any honey. Oh, but she has a quest too. Let's actually see what that is. Four onions. I don't have any crops whatsoever. Because I ate them all. Okay? I'm sorry, but I ate all of them. Every last bit. So there is a bunch of shops open. But what can we do about that? Nothing. Because we don't have any money. We can go shake trees and hope to get some items we can sell. But I was really hoping to get that butcher cake. Oh, there's a funeral to attend today. There's going to be so many funerals in the next few days. Whose funeral is this? I guess we'll come back later and see. It's one of many, that's for sure. Hey, Astra. Um, I can't turn in her quest yet because I don't have what you need. I can get a couple of cherries over here. Things are not looking good for us this Sunday. We can't afford anything. Oh, do we have to pay our taxes? No, we got three more days. Oh, that is one less burden we have to worry about. Okay, I guess all we can rely on is our forging skills now. Gotta take all the freebies we can get. give that tree a shake and we got nothing from it okay let's check the map one more time see if we can turn in our quest 
Oh yeah, he's out of his shop. Let's head into town and make a delivery. Um, where did he go? Okay, where are you, sir? I just want to give you what you asked for. There are so many people wanting things, and I can't help any of them. Where did he go to now? He's heading up to the mines? Why? <laughs> oh boy. Well, let's follow him up to the mines, I guess. Hopefully he doesn't disappear again. He is one fast walker. There he is. Hello, Henry. I've got something for you. What took you so long? Jeez. Uh, okay. But we got lamb sweetbread. Um, could you give us some money instead? Let's see if he has anything to trade. No, he does not. Let's just sell him some stuff like this lamb sweetbread. He obviously likes it, right? There you go. Have that. See you around. Okay, well, we've got a lantern now. So does that mean we can go into the mines? Or do we actually have to have, like, lantern oil? I don't know if this has lantern oil in it or automatically or not. Let's give it a go. <gasps> We're doing it. We're going into mines. Oh, it's so dark. Are we going to find anything whilst we're here? Oh, there's someone here. Who's this? It's Daniel Hopkins. Who, me? Did I do something? No, I just kind of wanted to chat. A blacksmith's furnace is a lot more powerful than a baker's oven. Be careful. Okay. Um, he's got some interesting stuff here, like, uh, better quality tools. He's even got nails. I would like these nails. We always need more nails. Here, have this stuff we foraged. You can even have my cherries. And that's gonna leave us with $8 to purchase those. Thanks, Daniel Hopkins. Um... Yeah, that's all we need from you, I guess. See you around. So, can we pickaxe up here too? Uh, no, I don't want to talk to you. But can you... Okay. We went through this hole. Are we going further down? Are we going to get lost? What's over here? I feel like we might end up getting lost in here. Oh, another place to pickaxe. Let's go back. So there's only specific places we can mine. But we're getting some stuff that's not stone. Okay, that's all mined out. We got copper ore. Oh. Did someone ask us to find their hammer for them? I believe someone did. Who was it? Maybe the blacksmith? Oh, there's people at the graveyard. I forgot about the funeral. How could I forget when there are so many going on? Um... I wonder, can we fast travel from right in the cave? That would be kind of neat. 
Let's explore a little bit more. Oh, this is a fiery cavern. Let's see what can we mine here. Can we mine anything? It seems like we should be able to. Okay, that is all we are going to get. And that's it for this zone. What an interesting cavern system. And let's see where this leads. Oh yeah, we can mine this rock. Okay, mine away. Looks like you'll need a steel pickaxe to break this. Okay, we'll have to upgrade our tool. So for now, let's see if we can fast travel out of here. And I think we'll head into town. We'll reach there by 5 p.m. Okay, what would you like, Alice O'Dell? Four potatoes cannot help you with that. Sorry, ma'am. I don't even have any planted. Hey, Mabel. Let's see what you want. You wanted the onions, right? More stuff I can't deliver. Well, let's go see if we can't return this this hammer. Where is the blacksmith gone to? How did he get over there? These people, they move too quickly. So is he in the town hall right now? Sure is. Um, this is for you, Roland. Um, we got some lantern oil. Okay. And he has another request. He would like some iron ore. Um, we're gonna accept that. We might get another piece because we'll go back into the mine at some point. But let's get out of here. Uh, it's 6 p.m. We still have some energy left. What should we use our energy on? We can do a little bit of fishing. But maybe we should get back to the farm and actually clear out some, some more trees. Because we still need wood. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Let's head on back to the farm. Give a few trees a shake along the way. Shake, shake, shake. Gladly accept that free wood. Because it doesn't really take our energy to do that, does it? Okay, where are the trees on our farm, though? There's a lot of rock. Here we go, here's a tree. Destroyed. I don't know. The small trees give three wood as well. So might as well chop those down too. Let's clear out this stump here. Stump only gave us two pieces of wood. Now I think we had like a hundred and seven pieces to start today, but we needed about two hundred to fix the bridge. So maybe we'll be able to get that bridge repaired right away. But it all depends on how much wood we can collect right now. I wish there was something I can do to heal my health. Like my heart is just looking terrible and we're not sick anymore. 
We are starting to get a little bit hungry, but not terribly hungry. Yeah, if only we can just heal our health. Maybe there is some sort of tonic or remedy we can purchase for just such an occasion. But obviously it's not something we can really afford. And oh no, our axe is broken. Well, now we know we can't actually get any more wood today unless we shake some trees. We'll spend a little time doing some fishing. It's 9.20 p.m. Maybe we should be looking at getting to bed. Got it. What did we get? The catfish? We got a catfish! Okay, so this waterway is not that bad after all. Let's get another good one. We still need to find some roach, but this is trash. The path of least resistance is going to be trash. So we'll have to figure out how we can get a replacement for our axe tomorrow. Still also need to... Ooh, we got some onions. Uh, nice. I didn't even realize those were ready. So we got two seeds from that. So we are going to plant those seeds. One there. And one there. So we only have a week left in the season. Still have no idea how to collect my wheat. What did I just eat? Uh, something putrid apparently. Because we're nauseated. Very nice. I wasn't trying to eat anything. I was trying to figure out how to harvest... Harvest the wheat. Okay, we're sick. Let's head to bed. First, we are gonna put some of this stuff away. Looks like we're about to pass out. Um, leave that there. And... We'll put the wood away. We have 184 pieces of wood right now, so just 16 more to go. Yeah, we'll get there soon enough. Let's just get to bed before we throw up again. Well, I don't really want to throw up in bed either. <laughs> okay, let's head to bed. And we will call it a night. Do we sleep until dawn, seven and a half hours, or until rested? Just about the same. Let's sleep until we're rested. And I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.